I've been in the industry for 52 years. I had a 28-year career in the Army and became the leading topographic engineer in the Army. I've done LIDAR work for FEMA, helped FEMA write their LIDAR standards, done LIDAR work for the U.S. Geological Survey, in which we do uh, LIDAR data acquisition and processing for the Geospatial Products and Services contract. For all other clients, I've recommended LIDAR as a technology of choice. But when it came to Alaska, their situation was different. They only need high accuracy LIDAR for a few cities and some uh, high value areas. Their big problem was being able to map through clouds, fog, smoke, haze, that sort of thing. And FSAR is the only technology that does that. So elevation is the key to mapping of Alaska. Imagery has a perspective view and things are positioned in the wrong place depending on, on your angle. You have, you have to have a view as though you're looking straight down. Well, you need a digital elevation model so that you can drape an image from a perspective view on top of that and sort of have it draped down to be in its correct position. We have acquired IFSAR data of so much of the state, and by having IFSAR data, we are able to produce accurate orthophotos now. We have been mapping Alaska since 2010. We're now over 60% complete, and I'm very proud that we're doing it so well.